What are those sounds? Well, let's add custom sounds to our custom mob. More in-depth topics for Minecraft modding available in the 121 modding courses linked below, covering writable and tameable entities, custom entity armor, and even custom entity inventories, among many more awesome topics. Alright, we found us back in Tell Your Ones War, and in this short tutorial, as you can clearly see, we are going to take a look at how you can add custom sounds, or just any sound, to your custom entity. Now, you will find that this is super freaking simple. Like, like so simple, you're going to say, I, why was there even a tutorial for it? Well, a couple of people actually do sometimes require these sounds. So let's take a look. So in your custom entity class, right? In this case, the gecko entity over here, you simply are going to override a couple of methods. If we were to start writing in sound, you can see there's the get death sound and get hurt sound and ambient sound and drinking sound and swim sound and swim high speed sound. And there's a couple of them. Now, usually you want the ones that return a sound event over here because those are the ones that actually get played, right? If you have something like the play attack sound, you can use that. However, then you actually have to play the sound within that method. These ones, you just have to return a sound event. Now, in our case, we're going to override the get ambient sound. We're going to return or get the get hurt sound. This is the get hurt sound right here. And we'll also override the get death sound. Now, in this case, we can basically return whatever we want. So for example, if we have some sound events from vanilla, we use sound events dot, and let's say, for example, the panda ambient, something like that. We can go for the hurt sound over here. That's going to be sound events. And then here we can do, let's see, what, what do we have? Fox hurt could work. Frog hurt could be somewhere around there. I think that that's actually quite nice. And then when it comes to the death sound, sound events dot, let's see, what do we have? We have a, mm, a cod doesn't really work. None of this works. Armadillo bat. I think a bat could work, maybe. Something like that. And now we have, well, basically different sounds over here set up for our for our custom gecko over here. And I can literally just jump into the game and let's hear if it works. And here we are back in the game and let's hear what they have to say. Oh, there you go. And if I hurt them, that is definitely a frog. And now, please, I'm sorry, but it has to happen. No, don't run away. No. There we go. That was a bat. And those were custom sounds added to our mob. Awesome. And that's going to be it for this tutorial right here. Next time in this video, we'll talk about throwable projectile entities. Hope to see you there. So, yeah.